What is going on YouTube? <clears throat> Derek here. Today we're just going to be tying some pump note teasers right here. You see I just tied up one. Right now in the winter time pump note come pretty good especially if you live around a power plant. They tend to linger around the warm water and attract them in. So stay tuned for how to tie a pump note teaser. Alright now first off to get started most importantly you want to make sure you have your hooks these are just a size two. I just thought these were going to be a good size and picked them up on sale on Black Friday. They're only two bucks for 14, so I figured that was a good deal. And then you want to make sure you have multiple different color, um, either feathers or fibers. Here we have just like a green sparkly and then like a purple sparkly and a white sparkly to imitate different um, types of baits. Um, because usually these pompano teasers won't only catch pompanos, they'll also catch like Spanish mackerel, ladyfish, even snook. I've caught a few on that. So you just want to make sure you have a variety of different colors. And then your string to help tie the um, fibers onto the hook. Scissors to help trim. And then super glue to help hold everything in place. And you can just get this at the local Dollar Tree. It's a dollar for two of them perfect for this. Alright so now since you gathered everything you want to first start by taking a hook out of the bag and placing it in your vise and I forgot to mention but this is just a cheap vise I think it was like twenty dollars a few years ago back at Bass Pro so you just pick up a cheap one it connects to the desk and then you just slap it in there hooks nice and snug you want to grab your string and then you want to make a few wraps to start holding the line on the hook. So you do a few wraps and then put the line down the, the shank of the hook and just wrap around it so it creates a nice base for the fibers to grab onto. And then once you do that, you go down the hook a little bit and then you go towards back up to the eye. Then you wanna clip off this extra just like that. And then next you wanna grab your Fibers, I'm going to start with the green sparkly. So then you just want to grab a nice little clump, I would say probably about like that. Then you just want to pull it out, put the rest off to the side. And then I'm going to make about probably inch and a half pinch like that and lay it right on the hook just like that. I'm going to do a wrap around there and it'll push it off to the side so you want to make sure it's centered on there. Then do a few other wraps. Go down. I would say probably about three or four wraps. And then you want to fold over this excess just like that. And it's going to create like a little bump and then you continue to wrap over that. And it's going to make it nice and plump. So then you wrap again up towards the eye of the hook. And then you're going to want to trim, I would say maybe about a half an inch past the hook. Just like that. These scissors aren't the best. <laughs> Just like that. Then you want to keep this all pinched together because then you're going to flip it like that and take another inch and a half section and lay it right on top because you want to plump this up. You're going to start again, do a wrap, and then make sure it's centered on top of the hook. Oh no, it's getting all, all tangled here. Can do another wrap make sure it's centered and you keep going just like that take it again fold it over plump it up go down the shaft of the hook 
and then back up towards the eye. And then that looks plump enough for me, so I'm going to go ahead and trim it. Then put the excess fibers over to the side. Now here, I'm just going to make pull some string out. I'm going to twist around twice, make a little knot, put it around the hook, and you're just going to pull it tight. I'm going to do that two or three times. If I can get it off my finger, you can just pull it tight. And it'll create like a little knot around the teaser. And then before I cut it, I'm gonna add a touch of super glue. So it'll hold everything in place. Just like that, and then you wait for it to dry. Give it a quick little blow. And I'm going to go ahead and snip it. And there we have a beautiful pop note teaser. Just like that. In a few minutes. You can always just trim it up too to make it look nicer. Or you can even use a smaller hook like a size 1. Depending upon what size you like. And that's about it. So go ahead, comment, like, share, and subscribe. Thanks again.